Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Antonio, with another channel tarot card message for you today. We are gathered for some spiritual messages. We're going to be using the Light Seers tarot deck. See what spirit has to say for you today. Don't forget to check your moon, rising, Venus, and North Node placements as well. Right? Comment if you like down in the comment section. If you're looking for any, any more information about me, check the description box below. Let's get into it. What does spirit has to say in regards to earth signs messages today? Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, spirit. What do we have for the earth signs? Five of wands, jumper. Okay. Grounding our reading today. We got the four swords. So this could have been some sort of a toxic situation here. Maybe some sort of a fight. Mm -hmm. You're in a very meditative state of this is what's grounding you at this time. Maybe you're contemplating or thinking about something, resting up, taking a nap. This could have been hard work, some sort of a training or some sort of a fight. Maybe you're seeking freedom at this time. Eight of Wands, this is travel. Mm -hmm. Sexual, oh yeah, this is, okay. Either releasing sexual frustration or this is what you're holding at this time. <laughs> If you have a lot of people trying to get into your energy, could be possibly. Could be possibly, right? <laughs> Nine of Wands, yeah. Someone's uh, very sexually primed, very sexually motivated, very sexually attractive. They're trying to get into your peripheral. That's F-boy, F-girl energy. This could also be um, the energy that you're in at, as well. Maybe you have been triggered or scarred about by something and you're seeking out some sort of a victory, some sort of a freedom. We have... Um, some sort of an insight or information coming towards you from an unlikely source here maybe someone that you don't get along with possibly or this could be um, a strong romantic uh, or sexual advance coming towards you either online through social medias right right because that's where everyone puts uh, releases their inhibitions right instagram facebook TikTok, all that type of stuff twitter but some sort of a knowledge hidden knowledge is coming towards you someone has a lot to say yeah strong sexual desires here king of wands we're dealing with leadership so this could be a motivational speech inspirational address uh could be dealing with a pole dancer um right someone very natural mm, could be dealing with a content creator mm -hmm. a professional here with the hierophant standing on integrity this could be someone very religious mm -hmm. taurus energy eight of swords on top of eight of wands yeah you have a lot of people so this is almost like love connection or something like that a lot of people are coming towards you or attracted to you uh, maybe this is how you see the people around you and everyone wants their shot at you everyone wants a piece of you here mm -hmm. yeah the emperor interesting enough the emperor showing up here so this is the energy that you're embodying or this is the person that's coming towards you again they're very sexually attractive or sexually motivated mm -hmm. This could be OnlyFans or Patreon or something like that. Some sort of a prawn. Four of Wands. Yeah, they're, they're wanting to... <laughs> they're extremely attracted to you here. They wanted to... Um, this usually is some sort of a foundation, right? The Soulmate Twin Flame card. So someone's coming towards you. They're wanting to deliver you some sort of a message to you in regards to a relationship. Maybe they're wanting to offer you something here. Five of Swords could be dealing with neglect someone just sees you for your sexual potential possibly or that just could be the initial energy that I'm getting here two of swords on top of the higher font mm, not sure if this person has any religious or spiritual boundaries here maybe this is why this person is coming towards you they're they're hyper sexual or something like that and they have no boundaries and they're coming towards you to teach them some sort of a spiritual boundaries or something like that some sort of an integrity now this could be the way that you're viewing people around you as well you you are showing leadership capability and you're looking at people around you like <laughs> is this what you guys are into <laughs> there's so many so many wands here it's funny next two cards pull we have nine of swords yeah the only thing i see here other than um the wands is the swords here the swords are how you're thinking right we have nine of swords here like oh okay all these people care about is sex like is there any integrity here it comes on top of the eight of swords right 
sleeplessness as well. You could be losing anxiety and toxicity, believe it or not. <laughs> if people are obsessed with you, they'll do all types of crazy things. They'll show up to your house in the middle of the night and have you losing sleep, all right? Talk about, uh, what was it, Othello, where he was at the young woman's uh, house, like, reading her love notes and stuff in the middle of the night. <laughs> I think she thought it was rather, rom rather romantic, but what about their neighbors? <laughs> Ten of swords, right? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You have the Eight of Cups, yep, ghosting. This could be someone walking away from maybe a, 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 a situation that they were not romantically inclined to stay in, to come towards you. They're wanting to get towards that Nine of Cups here. Four of Cups, yeah, they were in an unhappy situation or they're currently in an unhappy situation, right, that they're trying to break free of. Mm -hmm. They're wanting to have some sort of a connection here with you guys, um, Earth Signs. I'm gonna pull one more row for you guys just for giggles sake we have the queen of pentacles matriarch here strong feminine mm -hmm. very luxurious very uh down to earth very easy going could have a lot of um material success yep abundance here the sun card they're very creative you could be dealing with a mother mm -hmm. receiving some sort of a spiritual download they can't get to sleep or they can't find comfort we have sagittarius right that would be balance but it's on top of the Ten of Swords, right? Can't find comfort. Could be called any your soulmate here, right? Sexual frustration. Mm -hmm. Sexual desires, right? Trying to find a way to get out that creativity. Doesn't necessarily always have to be about sex, but... I mean... <laughs> I mean... We have Queen of Swords. Yeah. Thinking about something. Assessing something. Uh, this could be a small obsession, right? Overthinking a situation, needing to come to some sort of a conclusion, balance, or make a decision. Ten of Pentacles to close out the reading, right? They're thinking about uh, their legacy, their finances, right? Their home life, where they're going to end up, right? <laughs> I have a will, but who am I going to put on it, right? Am I going to get buried with my money? That is what I have for you. Uh, Major Arcanas. Do -do. Yep, we do have an attempt to call in a soulmate here. This would be marriage, Taurus, right? The divine masculine, Aries, right? Taking that leap of faith or nothing ventured, nothing gained, right? No pain, no gain type energy. We have the doctor here or the patient one, the therapist, the temperance. This could be an alchemist, right? Or some sort of a... Um, some sort of a celebrity here. Definitely getting content creation, right? We see the four coming in which is the twin flame card, right? The love about to be reciprocated in a situation they've been waiting around for. Four and four, which would be eight, in which we have eights. They've been waiting around for this. They're gonna tra come travel towards it, or uh, this could be all the people that's attracted to you at this time, a plethora of options. The tens, of course, ten of swords. This could be, again, someone worried about their legacy. Mm -hmm. right? Or someone has a lot of ideas. They have a lot of opportunities to invest in a lot of different people's ideas. The high court cards. Queen of Pentacles, King of Wands. Queen of Swords. Okay. A lot of strong manifestors here. Information on the way. This could be teaching or learning or something like that. Someone spying on you, right? Getting a... Um, a certain perspective or a dose of who you are, right? A leader, someone very creative, someone very down to earth, financially stable. And then, of course, uh, someone with uh, great discernment and accuracy, right? A leader, strong leader here. You want someone that's very creative, very bold, right? Someone's very down to earth. Uh, they're able to uh, contend financially here, right? Or bring some sort of a, oof, they're like the rock for people around them, right? And then we have the discernment here. Someone that's able to make decisions or someone that's able to listen to people, listen, um, hear people out, right? Could be dealing with a teacher, some sort of a motivational speaker, right? Could even be like a daycare attendant, possibly a pastor or a preacher. Definitely getting entrepreneur vibes. Yeah, there was another major arcana hidden here. A lot of creativity, right? Could be dealing with children. Nine of Swans and Nine of Swords. Moving out of toxicity, right? Creating some sort of a balance here. About to get ready to close out this karmic energy here. Could be some sort of a long journey, right? Possibly trying to distract themselves with a long journey. 
Five of Swords and Five of Wands. Again, yeah, it's a lot of frustration, a lot of sexual frustration. It's, it could be dealing with, you know what this is? It could be confidence. This could be dealing with confidence issues, right? Yeah. Not seeing the truth of things, not valuing oneself. But yeah, very interesting reading for you here. Earth signs, we could have a calling in your soulmate type of energy. Um, someone is seeking out a relationship or they're seeking out creativity or their life's purpose here. That's what I have for you. Like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel, uh, Earth signs. Yeah, you may want to watch the fire signs reading. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace.